fair viewers, we are at Gift and Thrift, as you may or may not know. Um, definitely, if you are enjoying the Lunch and Learn content, um, like and share and, um, and definitely sign up and subscribe to, to be a part of our lunchtime experiences. But I'm Melissa, this is Candace, and um, we're going to walk through the Gift and Thrift store in Harrisonburg and kind of find like the bargains and different things that are here. I already see something that I need, totally need. So come along. <laughs> Excellent. We first start off um, here right now, and Gift and Thrift is in a major um, remodel, and they're doing more of the building. But they have all of like the vintage um, linens and different stuff here, and some modern ones as well. Ta -da, ta da! I mean, yes, you can quilt a duck <laughs> and do different things. Um, oh my gosh, you can knit scarves and all this bunch of stuff. I took knitting, I flunked it, um, so I'll not be knitting up the scarves today. I like how things organized. Absolutely. So. Sewing things, craft items. Um, it's a great place to find things for upcycling. So um, if you've got a yen to like, you know, create, I don't know, a planter out of a tire, Gift and Thrift is a great place to come to, to get your supplies as well as to, to do some other things. So yeah, lots of crafty things here right now. The store will change when they when they finish remodeling it. They have a great silent auction, and that's where some of these really nice um, wool rugs are gonna be. Um, is back there, you can can do that. And behind Chris, as we really Really try to turn him around. He's so good to us. <laughs> is um, a wonderful selection of books. Um, and Book Savers is a part of um, Gift and Thrift, and so they specialize in books from children to adults. Um, they also do books online. We learned about um, when we did our behind the scenes tour. So, I mean, basically, if you want kind of, you know, young adult stuff, um, you know, there's all kinds of a selection here. Oh my gosh, The Hunger Games. Definitely, everybody needs that. Um, and I believe that's even an audio. Um, all the way up to novels and, and how to's and different things for adults. So, you could not only find your crafty items, but also your book items at Gift and Thrift. Now we're gonna go back through the rest of the store. Okay, large selection of clothing at Gift and Thrift, um, all organized by um, different, well, basically different color. And then you just kind of look to see if you can find your size. I have definitely found Talbots, Chico's, Coldwater Creek, all kinds of great stuff here. Um, so there's never a, a lack and, and always seasonal. So you can find everything from, from shorts to jeans. Follow this way. <laughs> I found great formals here. Mm. Fuzzy long jackets. If only it wasn't 80 degrees outside today. <laughs> Could get really excited about the fake fur. Candace, what do you think? It's, it's very Macklemore. It is. <laughs> but this is what I'm after today. Um, this is a vintage, and I mean, and we've been to antique stores and different things before. Finding something at Gift and Thrift is way cheaper than finding it at an antique store. Now, at an antique store, they're cultivating a selection for you. So basically, somebody has come out and done this going, whoa, that's a great coat. I can put that in my antique booth. Basically, this is a gift in there for about $15. You could sell it somewhere else for probably four or five times as much. It's a great Joseph Nays coat out of Harrisonburg, Virginia. Vintage, probably 1950s, 1960s. Look at those buttons. Um, and the swing aspect of it in terrific shape. Um, here today, $12. Going home with me. <laughs> So you know, maybe a little formal for something, a little new. <laughs> Definitely my style. I think I'll wear this to work tomorrow. You can always use a good moon. Yeah. Who doesn't need a good moon? I mean, if you watch Three's Company, you know. <laughs> Come along, more clothes. Kitty purse? Candace is so for you. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Maybe next time. It's gonna be nice. <laughs> One of my favorite things about Gift and Thrift is, and, and we were looking at this stuff earlier, is the silent auction items. So basically these are high-end um, jewelry or antique items that they have kind of picked out and you can actually bid on them silent auction. And how that works is you get a number and basically you bid until somebody doesn't bid for a week and after a week no one's bid higher than you, it's yours. Definitely got some great stuff here that way. But um, oh my goodness. Look at, they, look at these amazing suitcases with the stickers on them from people's travels. That's super cool. If they could tell stories, I mean, seriously. <laughs> look at this. That's it's a truck. It has stickers on it too. Absolutely. 
lovely crochet item in the back and all kinds of good quilts and things all on their silent auction. And then we get over here and Candace and I get really excited because we've got lots of good jewelry here and some really nice china. Pyrex, love me some Pyrex. A pottery barn dashboard clock. So not everything is vintage or antique. There's some modern stuff as well, but in the silent auction, it's always gonna be high end. Oh, somebody's charm bracelet. So very cool. I see a vintage sewing machine down there. Some silver. A Vaseline pitcher set. A bongo drum. And a really nice set of Courier and Ives um, dishware. It's Ironstone over here. And so again, these are items that you that you um, pick up and in silent auction bid on. And, and you basically just have to pay attention to your bid and make sure no one outfits you. So I've definitely gotten some good stuff that way. I have definitely spent too much money that way as well. <laughs> um, yeah, I mean, here's a... That is a, a really nice vintage Pyrex set. Um, I'm really tempted on that because um, not only do I love Pyrex, I really love Pyrex, um, but I really sell Pyrex. So I will probably buy that as, as we leave. But I'm like seeing like really cool Christmas ornaments down here. Um, I always pick up really neat purses here. Um, and I just, I don't even think that it's a, it's a Harrisonburg well-kept secret. I think everybody knows about gift and thrift and it's just about whether you get here in time to get the good deals. So. Candace is a first timer. I am. Awesome, what'd you think? I loved it, it's so much fun. It's cute, they have stuff that you can use at home, you can wear, stuff to collect, free gift to you, like the kitty purse. Oh, the kitty purse. Maybe not. <laughs> you know who I think would like the kitty purse? Leslie. Or Chris. Or Chris. Chris, do you need the kitty purse? Chris is saying no. Oh well. We can definitely give it to Leslie. Exactly. <laughs> Leslie will love the kitty purse. Cool. So come out to Gift and Thrift and you know, find a great deal. Sadly again, it is like 80 degrees outside, but this is going to be awesome next winter. So um, that's all for our Lunch and Learn today. Definitely like and subscribe to us on YouTube and keep watching and send your ideas about where we should go to Lunch and Learn because you know, we're always game to get out of the office. <laughs> Have a good day. Have a good day.